So I'm going to go from the very beginning and install Gaia Maps GPS. Okay, we're going to open that. Sign in first. Actually, let's, let's skip that. Let's try not signing in. So we got free. And with free, you get these right here. Uh, you got to get the premium with that. Right, so let's see if it works. I'm going to install uh, Lucky Patcher. This is the Lucky Patcher. It should already be updated. Open, provide permissions. I'm going to say deny, deny super users so we can see if it works without root. Okay, this often defines uh, luck, Lucky Patcher, so if you hit yes, it'll go into Google, and you can tell it that you don't want it to have Google Play Protect, so turn that off. And then go back to Lucky Patcher and say don't show that again. Hit no. Root access cannot be found. That's okay. Now, here are the menu of patches for Gaia. Since I don't have root, it's going to want to create a modified APK. And it looks like I'm going to need to update. So hang tight. i got to update my Lucky Patcher anyways. And then I'm going to update the, the custom patches. I was trying to already update Lucky Patcher and then package it, but I think we got to update it every time. Here it says, yes, I want to install, but no, I don't want to enable. I don't want to uh, mess up the ability to install other apps. So here we go. Hit settings, allow from this source. It's just trying to install the... Can't get things to click. There we go. Install. Let's go ahead and put those up there. Hit allow permissions. If you don't have root, that's okay. Update custom patches. Just gotta make sure everything's up to date. Both the app and the custom patches. And while that's doing that. I'm going to drag it to the we have the Gaia Maps and Lucky Patcher. New patches update. And once it's updated. Then we can go in here, menu of patches, create modified APK file, and now it's showing the custom patch applied APK. So let's hope this works. And it's all green. It's all patched. Now we want to go to the file. This says uninstall and install. Yes, we want to delete it and make a data and cache backup for installation. Yes, we want to uninstall it. And this one's going to reinstall the other one that's been patched. Here we go.
hopefully when we open it, we'll be in premium. Let's see if it pops up and says we're in free. It doesn't say we're in free. Try out. I forgot which one was premium. Satellite imagery. Okay, here we go. So we can turn on the on the world imagery, satellite with labels. So here we go. Now we can go log in. And we have premium. Alrighty, so I hope that explained it. And now after all that, you can just simply uninstall Lucky Patcher if that's what you want to do. Because now, or you can pa patch other apps. I mean, there's a whole list of things that can be patched. You can take out ads and, and other things. And if you don't use any apps that um, detect Lucky Patcher, then you're good to go to keep using it uh, for other things because it also lets you do certain switches for uh, paying for apps and stuff like that. And there's a toolbox. Okie dokie. That's how you get Gaia apps. Six point, what is seven point one point eight? Thank you for watching, and you have an awesome technology day. <laughs> Wilco out.